this is the Ogden Canyon guys and you're gonna see more of this when we go a bit on top further we're gonna drive around in between the mountains oh, look at the mountains the mountains the camera and the river that's so odd we have a mountain up there and a river here and we're at the Alden Canyon. <laughs> oh my gosh! <gasps> How beautiful is that? That's a beautiful view. If we didn't come here on this side, we would not have seen this. <laughs> so nice. And we're gonna see more of that later, I think. <sighs> yeah, we should go now. We're not shopping anyway. It's here, isn't it? It's all Christmas ornaments in here. And we won't be able to shop. We can't shop. So we're gonna go now. It's a nice so do you like anything? <laughs> this lady is Japanese, so you don't see the Japanese features in here, except for this one. <laughs> She's from Okinawa. Okinawa! We hope to see Okinawa in, in, in the future. <laughs> I hope soon, very soon. So we have the next destination we plan to go to from the Philippines is either Japan or South Korea. Ah, yeah, I'm yeah. 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 Go together. You're gonna be back in Okinawa this next year. Yeah, next summer. Yeah. So we have a friend in Okinawa already. <laughs> Almost a family. <laughs> a family, actually. <laughs> okay. Picture all together. Good. Mm -hmm. Napkin, maybe. 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 a bite of sandwich. Mm -hmm. The benefits. Yeah, there's a, there's there's a, probably three places where. So after breakfast uh, on the table, we were talking about taxes in in the U.S. and uh, traveling expenses, for example. So taxes, Dida, a tip for taxing in. <laughs> <laughs> it's a video. <laughs> so talking about taxes, we were in New York. We had this taxi fare, 58, 150, for example. And then Tita was telling us, tip for you guys is that you base your tips on the amount, 10% of the amount, of the total amount you pay. So <laughs> we were trying to compute the tax. Yeah. So whatever. Uh, on your receipt, normally you'd find like how much the tax is imposed on your uh, on your expense on your on whatever you ate in the restaurant or uh, the expense you're supposed to have in a taxi. <laughs> you double the tax uh, amount, and that's your tip. And you tip it to the person you're giving it to, not on the uh, restaurant because sometimes it might not go to the uh, the person who served them. So if you want them to get it personally, give it to them in cash. You don't write it in your receipt and then have it added to your bill actually. And on the taxis, that was the same case. And traveling, we were talking about getting delayed. Last year when we were in traveling in Europe, we only had a medical insurance. And medical insurance only covers medical expenses if in case you get sick somewhere, you needed a checkup, or you know, you're hospitalized for something, maybe food poisoning, you know, whatever it is. Um, and this time, because last during that time, we had like delays in traveling. We got stuck two days in. Turkey and then coming back to Kuwait after two days the luggages were still in Paris and they had to send it over back to Kuwait after two days and uh, insurance coverage would mean if we, if, if we have taken a full insurance coverage we could have made a big amount of money <laughs> from the insurance company because they cover the expenses for staying in Turkey two days and then whatever you spend for like uh, meals and clothes in case you don't have because our luggages were left off in Paris that would have been covered and yeah so this time we're traveling US 
we have a full medical insurance, a full full insurance coverage. So you know, so in case something happens, like we get stuck in New York back before going back to Kuwait or from Las Vegas, or from Utah, anything that we spend for can be covered or taken back or reimbursed through an insurance company we've taken in our insurance from. So that's two tips for you guys very important ones when you travel always get full coverage insurance yeah that's not much it's not much of a difference from getting a medical insurance you're, you're supposed to have a medical insurance coverage anyway it's probably cheaper for me to mail it actually yeah. Marielle we were looking at this and because you love baking like our tita to sing here we wanted to buy you some stuff but we are thinking that if we have it packed on our luggages <laughs> We're gonna be charged for each luggage twenty five. On your second luggage, you're well, gonna be charged fifty dollars. Well, and then address an extra, and which is your third one, uh, is I gonna cost you for all three eighty five dollars. Uh, and that's a lot because enough? from Utah we'll be traveling. Yeah. That was a charge from New York to Utah. And if we buy for Morelli, that's going to be a lot, uh, a lot to handle for a uh, luggage expense. From Utah, we'll be, we'll be in Las Vegas after two weeks or more than a week. And from New Las Vegas, we travel again back to New York before flying back to Kuwait. So that means a lot of expenses. And and uh, to those who would like tumblers anyway in Starbucks, they don't have U.S. tumblers here. That tumbler that I collect also, that I have like about 56 now, they don't have a U.S. version of that. So I'm sorry, you guys, I can't have anything for you. Only from I, I will pick up some things for you when I'm back in New York before going back to Kuwait. Cemetery Point. It's a good place to go. Um, a day, um, you know, for like picnicking and swimming right there. What is this? Alone, Tito? Oh. But you need to work. <laughs> Do you know how to do uh, uh, Somebody's got some quarters up on the table. Where? Oh. Thank you very much. Well, there is no ball. Look at all the dollars in there. <laughs> I bet. That's right. They have no space to put their money in. They don't seem to have a place to put their money in. It's all on the city. <laughs> it's far. This structure was built in 1850s and became a salon in 1879. Well, that's a long time ago. There's a lot of deer around here. Well, look, look in the snow, you'll see tracks. And that's normally a deer. Well, the Smith and Edwards Company, it's called the Bad Boy something store. <laughs> Bad Boy store. So I was thinking there would be naughty stuff in here, but it looks like a hardware store. But the grocery store all in the same roof. Like, bang, bang. <laughs> we are in a Bad Boy store. So. What do you call this store, Tita? Huh? Uh, what do you call this store? It's Bad called... Uh, Bad boy something. What what's this name? What? The what store's name? Time? The Bad Edwards. Smith and Edwards. Oh okay. What what is the, what's that boys a yeah, country boy store? And go take all those. Yeah, that's why. It's a bang bang area. <laughs> <laughs> and that the fishes. Peter knew he, she would found you she outdoor, would find you here. The outdoor gear. Marielle. You're really gonna like this. All the spatulas are in different colors. This section is for all the baby olds. They've got all the different 
What's this? Types of peppers in here. So many tacos, seasoning, tarragon, leaves, thymes, flavored salt, mushroom salt, pumpkin pie spice. That's a lot. You're gonna love these. <laughs> It's like, oh no, I'm lost in the jungle. <laughs> this is all the nomad hunters' gears. <laughs> really, Macy's is like a real big thing in Lewis. I only get to order at Macy's online from Do you see the uh, windows? Can you see how they frost? Oh, uh, yeah. This is like an emergency shopping rush. We were having our dinner for 20 minutes. We had to cut it off because Tita needs to go shop at Macy's. They're having a one day sale. So it's not gonna be on sale tomorrow anymore. So we have to go. So from Clinton to you to Salt Lake, it took us about 25 minutes to drive. Did I say I have enough shoes? <laughs> We were talking about shoes earlier and I said I have enough but these look like uh, good deals. Yeah? 